These guys gotta get some pockets or mittens because they oh, this is all they're doing. Maybe we could just heat the food this way. Seven eleven. Ah, five. Okay. <laughs> what are you guys making? Your roll. <laughs> you know, fall is here. Yeah. And, and, and you know, and I want to give a little salute to the Wisconsin pork producers. Okay. You're just in today's little trip that I took from New London. We got a good family of uh, uh, producers, the Migalskis in New London. There's a group in Shyocton. Uh, one of the vice presidents, Mike. Uh, lives in Black Creek. So all the way here and on the grill, I've got Wisconsin pork. There you Love go. It. What a great idea. So we got some wonderful pork chops that I'm searing up on the grill, getting nice and toasty done. And what we're going to do is we're going to do Aneta pork chops. Mm, Aneta? Aneta? Uh, yeah. Yes. Aneta one? Yeah, it's okay. Aneta one. <laughs> uh, sauerkraut, brown sugar, uh, some great fall colors here. We have some wonderful uh, Wisconsin cranberries that were dried. I've got some onions in there. We got some great apples, Ooh. diced up apples, brown sugar, kraut, uh, onions, cranberries. Are uh, these Macintosh or? Does uh, they are Macintosh. Are they? Does it yes. matter what kind you use? No, or? but they are I Macintosh. I thought they were a honey crisp. No, 69 cents a pound. I couldn't apples. go wrong. <laughs> we're going to take those seared up chops uh -huh. and we're going to place them right on top of that mixture. Ooh. Everybody has a problem doing pork chops on the grill because they have a tendency to overcook them. Yeah. So we're going to keep them nice and moist. These are just seared up. They're still raw on the inside. I'm going to take a bottle of, uh, of Merrill's Original. Mm -hmm. Oh, good choice. Barbecue. It is good. And we're going to pour that whole bottle over the top of that. Mm. Yum. And I'm going to seal that up, put it back on the grill, and we're going to let that bubble for that hour until we just come down again. Oh, the they are going to be delicious. Can I have another one then? Yeah, after another, that? another one. <laughs> Can I, I, like the, I like to have another one, you know? <laughs> what are you no, I started cheating. I went to, to a festival, and I went ahead and got the Cajun chops, which okay. you get them already, already uh, seasoned and everything. But I did this a couple weeks ago, and Doug at Festival Foods over in Appleton wanted to know I'm doing the Sicilian steak. And it's a Sicilian steaks braised to do. I'm using what they call today, I'm using what they call a Kansas City strip, which is a little bit different than the New York strip. You sing Kansas City. Kansas City, here I come. Okay. Kansas City star, that's what I are. All right, and what I'm going to do is this is go ahead and has a bone in it. If you're doing a New York strip, mm -hmm. it doesn't have the bone. But all we're going to do is just really put the breadcrumbs, season them on both sides on there. Let them sit in the refrigerator outside for get oh, 20 minutes, 30 minutes, but you want to coat it very well. And then I'm just going to grill them up. It'll have a really nice crust on them also. Do you think it's better when you still when you leave the bone in, or does it have I more like flavor? I like it with or? the bone. I always start like the flavor on that. I like sirloin with the bone in it also. Okay. But uh, the Kansas City Strip does have the bone in it. it makes a big difference and a good price. $5.99 a pound. Good right deal. And, and cooking wise, it takes a tad bit longer because the bone doesn't uh, it helps to not radiate the heat. If okay. You will. So gotcha. it takes longer to cook. You guys doing can, anything? Can we have another one? Another one? Okay, I was going to try to do, some, do something with Cajun. Well, you know, we, okay. we just uh, we, have another one. We have a little announcement, and, and our good folks at Festival Foods uh, this week are going to start carrying Mad Dog and Merrill's barbecue sauces and spices. Yeah, so, right. way to go, guys. If That's you could awesome. Do us a favor, we'd appreciate it. Absolutely. Yes. Hey, let's take a look at the screen. Okay. Because. That's Mad Dog us. and Merrill Midwest Grillin'. When is it, you guys? Sunday mornings at 9.30. Got a brand new show on tailgating this week. Yes. Looking forward to yeah. it. All right, we'll be right back. You're watching Good Day Wisconsin.